So in this video, we have a uniform plank AB of mass 25 kilos is pivoted at A and held at an angle of 30 degrees to the vertical by a force F applied at B, perpendicular to AB. Find F. Okay, so this is my diagram and the plank we've been told is uniform. So its weight acts through the center and it has a mass of 25 kilos. So its weight will be 25G. Now, we haven't been told the length of the rod, so I could just call that length L and that length L. OK. Um, now, because uh, the plank is pivoted at A, we need to think about a normal reaction force um, working, uh, well, its components, one working vertically and one horizontally. So we'll call this Ry and this Rx. OK, so this is the diagram that we're going to work with. So next up, uh, let's think about what we can do. Now, resolving forces here isn't really going to work for me because I don't know Ry and I don't know Rx. So I've got two unknowns in either direction. So it probably makes sense to take moments about point A because then I don't need to work with Rx and Ry. So taking moments about point A, I'm L metres away from the 25G. And if we break that up into components, then this angle here is going to be 60 degrees. So this angle here would have to be 60 degrees. So this will be 25G cosine 60. So I'm L metres away from the 25G cosine 60, and that's going to be going around clockwise. So take away L times 25G cosine 60. And we're 2L away from F. And that's going to be going around an anti-clockwise motion. So plus 2L times F. That's going to be equal to 0. So I can divide through by L and get rid of that straight away. And we get 2F is going to be equal to 25G cosine 60. So I'll put G as 9.8. 25 times 9.8 times cosine of 60, divide through by 2, and we get 61.25 newtons. And so that's F as required.